The redeveloped Horsham track has been in operation for six months now with great results for both racing and animal welfare. GRV joined forces with Sydney's University of Technology for the new track design that had animal welfare as its overriding priority and as a result Horsham is now rated one of Victoria's safest tracks. The original scope for this build was to keep um, the specs as they were, however um, once the UTS study was able to overlay their, uh, their thoughts and their, their, their findings on the old track, um, it was found that the old track was just far too narrow. So we, we widened the track from about five and a half average to about six and a half average um, and introduced a transitional turn both into the catching pen and, and on the first turn. So very subtle changes. Now there's also been changes made to the camber of the track. What is camber and what were the changes made? The camber is the angle for which the outside plinth and the inside plinth are the way in which the track falls. The cambers at all Victorian tracks are 1 in 12 or 8.33%. This particular track's been increased to 10%. And again, a recommendation out of the UTS study and, and essentially what that means is that the dogs tend to go into those uh, turns and are able to um, hold their line a lot better than less camber. Scott, talk me through the positioning of the boxes, the drop on boxes and why the changes were made. Yeah, so originally uh, Horsham had a 570 metre start, a 480 metre start and a 410 metre start. Using the UTS study, the club decided against introducing a 570 or reintroducing a 570 metre start. So that came out of play. We put a 480 metre in and then moved it back to get a bit more distance. So it's a 485, really nice run into the first turn. And then the biggest change is the 410 metre start, which is now a, a set of drop-on boxes, um, which allows the dogs really to come out and run in a really straight line to that first turn. Now this track, like 11 of our 13 clubs, have Burrumbeet sand. Why that choice of sand? If you're using the same product, it's a lot easier to compare notes across the state. So look, it loves water. It's a it's a river sand. Uh, that being said, it's a you know it's a really nice surface for the for the dogs to run on. Now, last of all, are GRV happy with the changes that have been made to this track and how it's functioning now? Oh, look, I'm a bit biased because I was involved in the build, but um, the data so far is, is, is exceptional. Um, this, this track is, um, is in our, our top couple when it comes to the key metrics, and one of those is the, the main driver, which is animal welfare, and um, our injury level on this track is, uh, is as good as any in the state, and, um, and we're really happy with the way in which it's all been built. We're really enjoying what's happening here at Horsham. It's uh, been a, a great uh, lift for the whole community. We've got people from uh, down south, um, like David Gill and Anthony Azapati, these fellas, uh, they'd sooner come here and race than anywhere else. I'm very pleased and wrapped with it. Well, the new track has certainly been a great result for Horsham and Greyhound Racing in Victoria.